Hey YouTube, what's up? So in this tutorial I'll be teaching you how to make a background smudge effects with spray paint on stickers. So this works best if you have two stickers that uh, you kind of want to get an equal effect for. Now uh, with paper stickers like as priority mail stickers, they uh, will give different effects than uh, say vinyl or a more plastic based sticker. So what you're going to want to do is set up a quick easy background, nothing special. Um, but make sure the paint is a little bit thicker in areas than you traditionally want. So I'm just going to go in and just do some uh, little bits to kind of get a couple different colors in there. And then uh, usually uh, you do it on both stickers that you want, but uh, you know you can do a little bit on one if you really want that color to show through. And then simply just take the one sticker and uh, place it on top of the other in any form you want. Uh, definitely don't uh, like, I don't, I don't know, like place it in a direction you don't want the design to kind of go. So I like to uh, place it e either even or with a slight angle and then you can kind of just move the sticker a little bit. As you can see the paint wasn't very wet so I'm gonna do that again as it is kind of hot out and uh, it dried a lot quicker than I anticipated. But uh, so now you got, I've got wet wet paint on top of one sticker and then I'm gonna simply just smudge it away and you kinda get these cool drawn out effects um, you can also come in with uh, little tools or whatever and if the paint's still wet you can kinda make designs in it um, I'll put a layer on and then with a cap or whatever you can kinda do like smudges um, I'm not sure I've never really used that in practice uh, I just kinda have done it here and there I don't really know a huge purpose for it I haven't found it to be like an awesome tool or whatever but it's kind of a quick way to create uh, these kind of interesting backgrounds that are a little bit uh, not traditional I guess and uh, then you can apply some of the other tips like I've said in other videos uh, to these so uh, you can create kind of like a whole collage of different styles or whatever and uh, make your sticker backgrounds pop and then hit like a stencil on top of it or something to make it uh, really that much better of a sticker so that's gonna do it for me hopefully this helped you and uh, you learned something in this video if uh, you did please hit a like in the bottom as I do put a lot of time into this and uh, that's really gonna do it for me comment rate subscribe peace